What's up, Dan fam? Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 14. And today, I'm gonna do a little segment called Keech's Kitchen. And we are going to be making Christmas cookies. So, if you guys don't know, I love to bake. I've been baking since I was like super, super young. And I literally didn't even need measuring cups or ingredients or anything. I literally got so good at one point. Um, so, I thought it'd be kind of fun, you know, to go back to my roots and bake a little bit. Bet you thought I wasn't gonna be in this video. Well, y'all were wrong. What's up, baby? You missed me? You got their hopes up for no reason. Oh, <laughs> me, that's me. Guys, I do not know how to cook. I don't know the slightest thing about baking, cooking, none of that. I know a lot about eating. So, um, she's gonna teach me a little bit, gonna walk me through. I'm going, going to be her what? Sous chef? How you? Shoo, shoo is chef. it sous chef or is shoo, it sous chef? Two chef. One chef, two chef. Two chef. Red, red chef, blue chef. All right, guys. I'm gonna be her right hand cook That's or right, right hand my baker. My right hand man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, so the ingredients are. I literally just found this like recipe on Pinterest. Super simple. The ingredients are one cup of butter, one and three quarters cups of sugar, regular sugar, two eggs. I'm allergic to eggs, so we're not gonna use egg, and we're going to do heavy whipping cream instead. And then also one teaspoon of vanilla extract, a quarter teaspoon of almond extract, one cup of sour cream, which I don't think I'm gonna use that because that's whack. Um, five and a half cups of all-purpose flour, one and a half teaspoons of baking soda, and one and a half teaspoon of baking powder, and a half teaspoon of fine salt. So the first step is in a large bowl, babe. Yep. I tell you what to do, you do it. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so in a large bowl, we're gonna mix the butter and sugar. So, unravel these. And then the sugar. So, one cup of butter, which is two sticks. And make sure it's like room temperature, like kind of soft. <gasps> ow, 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 ow. Oh my It's okay. It's, it's all good. It's not lit. <laughs> Sorry. My bad. It's fine. It didn't look. look the sour cream cut. <laughs> oh my god. I was Sorry. really not expecting Sorry. that. Alright. One and three quarters cups of sugar. Whoa. A little too much, but you know. Ooh. Look at that. Look at that. You really good at that. I was born for this, babe. I was born for this. Okay, so your butter and sugar should look like this, and then you are ready for the next one. I'll do a little more. A little more? Yeah. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 not double. A quarter teaspoon of almond extract. Alrighty, guys. Our dough is done being chilled. So. What I'm gonna need you to do is to flatten it out. Okay. And we don't have a rolling pin. I don't know why, but we don't. So we're just gonna flatten it out. <laughs> Come on, muscles.
counter. Let's play some. Let's play some. Okay. I want an itty bitty. All right. So once you have flattened it out, we're just going to be placing these cute little cookie cutters. Okay. Um. Honestly, super simple. Pretty self-explanatory. Right now we're gonna peel the dough around it. I think that's the easiest way. Oops. Oopsie. Oh, guys, I can't stop eating. I need to stop. I need to save it for the actual cookies. Oh my god. This is the cutest gingerbread ever. Oh! They're so cute. Okay, with leftovers, you can just keep on making more and more until you run out. Can you try it? You ready? Catch. <laughs> Damn, she one handed that thing. One handed caught that. Alright, should I put them in? Yes. For how long? Um, so we are going to put them in for eight to nine minutes. Until the edges are slightly golden. But make sure you like check on it. I learned that the hard way with some things. And with the leftover dough, you just store it in the freezer and it will be all good. Alrighty, so now that we are waiting for our cookies to cool, we are going to start prepping for the decorating part. And we are just going to put the icing in this bag. This just makes it easier to like make it kind of look pretty. I honestly don't know how this is going to turn out because I'm so bad at decorating cookies. But we're going to try. Well, luckily for you, I feel like you'd be really good at it. We got to be the honest. gingerbread house champion. We got the pro in the house. I'm good at like the baking and making sure that it tastes good. But I think that taste is way better than you know than a parrot's. Yeah, my sister tastes so good. Okay, we got light blue. All done. Alrighty, now we're gonna do this one. This is like a Grinch green. <laughs> I didn't know it would turn out like this. I thought it was gonna be like a dark Christmas green, but honestly, I think this is kind of cool. Perfect. We got green done. Now this one. Guys, I honestly hate buying pre-made things like pre-made frosting. Pre-made cookies, I like to just literally do it all from scratch because then I know exactly what is in it and it just makes me feel a lot like better about it, you know? Cool. Yeah. Wait, no, now I have pink. I want it. Yeah. I tried to make a red, but this is all we could come up with. Just cut them really small. Mm -hmm. Don't do too much. Alrighty guys, so we are all ready and prepped and we have these little like little frosting sizers. Perfect. Simply. Yeah. Okay. Cute. So we have these little frosting um, frosting tips <laughs> and you can put them on here and we're just going to switch them out depending on what size we want for the colors. And then we also have all of these really cute sprinkles. Very cute, very cute. La cucaracha, la cucaracha, Ramina. Okay, are you ready? Ready. Let's go. Oh my god, it started coming out the other side. <laughs> Yo. Hey, you're really pumping them out.
right? Let's do a montage, baby. Huh? Mm -hmm. What are you eating? The frosting. Wait. Where did my star go? Where did my little star go? That was my favorite one. Did you eat my favorite star? No, I just had frosting. You ate my favorite star. I'm your favorite star. There can only be one, so I had to eat the other. I'm gonna bite the head off your reindeer. <laughs> no, not my baby! Crunchy. Pretty good. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. They're pretty good. Mm -hmm. Damn fam, how about them cookies? Mm. How about mm. them cookies, babe? Good? The center of the big ones is like soft. Really? Ooh, that looks pretty nice. Nice and crunchy, guys. That was a fun, mm -hmm. fun time, was it not? Mm-hmm. I I'm was like, not the best. Like Christmas. Oh, it's been Christmas. Ever since we got a tree, it's been Christmas. But Christmas cookies is like, you know. Is that the icing on the yeah. cake? No pun intended, y'all. Guys, we had a great time. We hope you enjoyed our cookie recipes. Um, our decorating, I think, was a little bit subpar. I think that could be improved um, next year. Honestly, my snowflake, though, is actually really cute. Snowflake's pretty bomb. Mm -hmm. Until I you broke one of the legs off. Guys, we love y'all. We're going to go get some rest. Like, comment, subscribe. We love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 15, baby. Good night. Love you. Bye.